welcome into my channel and today in this video i'm going to show you how you can fully optimize your pc for fortnite with your any laptop or low-end pc or any modern generation pc so make sure to guys watch my this whole video because in this video i'm gonna cover every aspect which help you to increase in the performance and getting more fps into the fortnite chapter 3 season 3 so guys let's start over this video so first of all the most important thing guys most of people are using the stretch resolution and that sometimes reduce your fps so now what you need to do you need to now press windows r together from your keyboard and now we are going to uh, change the config settings of our fortnite so you need to open the windows plus r button and you will go to this kind of this run window now you need to type here data and press enter from your keyboard and it will take you directly here into uh, this directory go for this local folder and find out here fortnite game folder not the epic games not the epic games launcher open up the fortnite games folder go for the save config windows client and there you will find out this game user settings so now here what you need to do right click here go for the show more option go for the properties and there you will find out this configuration settings and open with make sure to always open this file as the uh, notepad go for this change button and uh, select out the notepad from here click ok and make sure to also uncheck this box from here then hit apply and click ok now double tap here and uh, this window will be pop up on your screen now you need to scroll all the way down and find out the resolution size x and the resolution size y so here you can check it out here my resolution size x and y this is 1600 by the 900 so you need to just simply change it on a native resolution like i have a 1920 by the 1080p for uh, good pcs you can try the 1920 by 1080p and for low end pc you can go with the 1280 by the 720p uh, for getting more fps so simply change this resolution now go for the file and hit save and close out this window so guys now in the next step i'm going to show you how you can properly download and install the driver on your pc with the nvidia or the amd graphics card so first of all you need to open up any browser and you need to download the driver for your gpu so for example for the amd card you need to go for the uh, google search amd drivers and press enter from your keyboard and it will take you here open up this first website for the amd.com slash en spot and uh, from here you need to go for this graphics option and find out uh, the model of your gpu or series like for example radio 500 series and radio 500 series again and select out your gpu whatever you have guys click on the submit button and then you need to now select out the operating system which you have like i have the windows 11 if you have windows 10 go with it click on this expand button click on the download and download the software on your pc so once you download it guys and now i'm gonna show you how you can do it with your nvidia gpu there is two methods for updating your driver first is open the nvidia geforce experience you can simply search geforce experience application and from there you can easily update your driver go for the driver option click for check for update and make sure to update your driver onto the latest variant so i already have the latest driver geforce game ready driver and you can simply install it also on your pc so guys in the next step now i'm going to show you some best settings for your windows for getting the more performance or fully optimization of your pc or laptop so first of all you need to reduce the visual quality of your pc therefore you can save your gpu or the ram and the cpu for getting the more performance into the fortnite so what you need to do you need to go for your windows icon right click here and there you will find out the system option click here it will take you into the settings scroll down and there you will find out this advanced system settings click here on this option go for the performance settings and set it on to the adjust for the best performance hit apply and click ok in the next step now you need to open up your windows settings so how you can do it you need to right click here go for your display settings from there find out this related settings for windows 10 you will find out this option on the right side of your screen and uh, here is our graphics option for the windows 11 open up the settings and now you need to find out here the game so search fortnite here i find it go for the option and set it onto the high performance of your gpu so now in the next step i'm going to show you the best settings which you can do for your nvidia gpu control panel and for the amd you can also visit my channel or open up the video from the i button for getting the best settings for your amd gpu so for nvidia right click here go for show more option open up the nvidia control panel and now you need to follow all the settings which i'm going to show you now so go for this 
uh, manage three settings of your GPU and there you will find out all these options now what you need to uh, change here there is no more setting which you need to do go for the low latency click here and set it onto the ultra then again scroll all the way down and there you will find out that the monitor is if it is compatible with G-Sync or V-Sync go with it then here is our power management it is right now onto the normal so set it onto the prefer maximum performance now scroll down here is our prefer refresh rate so I have set it onto the highest available which is 240 Hz and here is our texture filtering negative LOC and uh, texture filtering quality set it onto the uh, performance high performance once you set it scroll down and yeah almost it's done hit apply and now i'm gonna show you the best setting for your uh, windows 10 or 11 settings so you need to go for your windows search and type here game mode and you will find out here this game mode settings open up go for your game mode and make sure to turn it on now you need to go for the windows update and make sure to always update your windows or onto the latest version whatever is released because it will come with most of optimization inbuilt and help you to getting more fps in fortnite or more performance from your pc or laptop so guys now here is our last step for optimizing our cpu or optimizing all the core and thread of our pc so you need to open up your browser again open up the new tab and you need to type up to packs.com or you can simply open the link from the descriptions and that will take you here onto this website you need to go for the search icon and search here park control and press enter from your keyboard it will take you onto uh, this page and there you will find out these two uh, files make sure to download this one which is the download park control unlocked for free this is the free version you need to download it scroll down click on this uh, download button which is the download park control click on this link it will take you onto the media file or the google drive or this website click on this latest version and click on this download button and download the software on your pc so once you download it so i have already got one here if i could i just show you here is the park control and if i show you how to install it simply click here click yes and simply install it as usual you uh, install other software click on the install button so i already got one here on my pc so if i just show you here it is now you need to disable all of this option from here and click on this drop down set it onto the bit some high performance make activate and then check mark onto the bitsum dynamic boost enable then click ok and guys these settings will really help you to increase in the performance of your laptop or pc so i hope so you love it so please make sure to subscribe turn on the bell notification drop a like on this video so till at the next video peace out